I am heading to my farm today for serious cultivations, guys. No, it started raining lately, and everyone is busy uh, with cultivations. And I'm starting cultivation today in my farm. I'm taking the whole family. I'm taking the whole family to the farm so that we can cultivate there. Everyone is there today. Everyone is there. We are all going to participate uh, in the farming, guys. So we want the farm to finish. If it is not going to finish today, then maybe the second time of cultivation will make it finish completely. So, here it is. We have started to farm that place. I mean, that, that uh, parts of field that time. And the, and the sagums are growing, you can see them, they are still very small, but they are growing. They are growing in a well, actually. So I'm um, uh, heading to where uh, there is large farm, and people are there, they are cultivating. They came earlier this morning before me, and I'm now going to join them in cultivating, guys. There is nothing good like cultivations. Cultivation is good. It helps so much. It uh, makes us food secure. And you know when something of something like famines or hunger it strikes the community, and you are among those who cultivate, who cultivate, you no, know, you will be on safe side. So I want to be on safe side next year. You want to be on safe side next year so that we can be a little bit food secure. We are cultivating different types of crops here. We are going to cultivate groundnut. You see there, that is where we are going to, cal to put groundnuts. It is, the ground is clear there. We will put some groundnut there, you know. We will put some groundnut right there. Yes. You see, do, guys, do you know this, whatever here? I don't know the English name of this, whatever, of this uh, vegetable here. In our local language, we call it a core. We call it a core, by the way, in our local language. It is very, very nutritious. Very nutritious hmm? food, this one here. But I don't know it in English name. So we are collecting it here. We want to test it today. You know, it, it has grown nicely here. So we assign one of the family to collect it. As we are cultivating here, you know? serious cultivation, guys. We use hoe here. We use hoe, but actually, we just changed to using hoe recently. You know, some years back, I think from uh, we started using hoe in in 2000, I think. But from 1990s down there, we use maloda. We nail down and we start cultiv cultivating the ground. I mean the land. But from 2000 uh, up to it. date, hmm. people have, people change it, upgrade it to whatever, yeah, upgrade it to, uh, to hoes. They to use hoe. I also use hoe, but I'm not that good. I'm not that good with the hoe farming. Not that good with hoe farming actually. What I know is maloda. With maloda, I can huh? cultivate a very very big land. But this gentleman yeah. here. They are used to this one here. You can see how they are cruising or how they are cutting or digging the farm, guys. It is a very, very large farm, guys. It is a very, very large farm. If the rain is going to rain nicely, as it do yearly, then everything will be fine. And the land here also is also nice. The land is also good. The land is also very, very nice. It's very, very, very good. I tell you guys, it is very, very nice. You know? Everyone is digging. Everyone is digging seriously. You know, we don't spare any minutes when it comes to cultivation. When it comes to cultivation, everyone participates. Everyone participates when it comes to cultivation. All must participate. It is must in the household. When it is cultivation time, everyone go there. 
you first go and cultivate. When your time comes to leave, you will go. You know, when people go to farm, one must go there, you know. Yes, uh, brothers and sisters, I thank you for always coming to watch in this video. Kindly today, kindly today uh, try to subscribe, click like and share the video, let more people get it. Guys. Yeah. We need to support one another as a human family. We will grow by supporting one another, you know. We really need your support by subscribing to the channel. And also share the video, let others get it. And comment your thought also in comment sections. If there is anything which need to be adjusted or we need to be put correctly, then put it in the comment section. We will take it seriously and definitely we will correct it. Yeah, subscribe. Help us to reach uh, 1K. We are on our way to 1K, by the way. We are on our, our, we are on our way to 1K. I know about 48% of our brothers and sisters watch and they don't watch while they are subscribers. And about 50, 52, about 52% of brothers and sisters, they watch here and they don't subscribe. They just watch the video and then they go without subscription, likes and comment. Today, I'm asking you, I'm actually begging you, let me say, I'm begging you to subscribe click like and share the video guys it is farming day seriously we are digging here guys this is uh, the farm we cleared some man bugs i think i put the video here and uh, some of you saw it it was clear and everything was done here right now it is time for cultivations for footing the sagum there, you know, our main foods here, our main foods which we consume is uh, sagum. Sagum is commonly consumed in the northern Varagazal, Awil. So we, we, we eat whatever, sagum, peanuts, and also beans. I uh, know uh, we, don't, we don't eat beans much. What we eat is uh, sagum, groundnuts. And simsim. Those are the things we use to eat here. And we plant them. Commonly. There are plants here. In every farm. You can. In, in every farmer is farm. There is sagum. Groundnut and simsim. You know. So it used to be like that guys. Yes. We don't miss. We don't miss sagum. Meals. And groundnuts. Especially grounded first. Yes. This gentleman is seriously digging here. The, the, the farm is a bit hot. It's a bit dry, but with this hole, it is not difficult. We are farming it nicely. You know. The only thing I like about our boys here, you know, they work. The only thing about the, the only thing I like about our boys, they they, they they work they work so much, especially during farming. They help. They help to cultivate a lot. That's the only good thing I love about our boys here. They farm so much and they can't get tired completely. Even they always call me, Yes, why are you not coming? So that we go to the farm and dig the farm, you know. Time time is go time is going. And I always tell them, no, wait, I'm coming. Today, I have come with them to the farm. And we are cultivating the whole farm. Though we will not finish it today, I think, in the second round or third round there, we will finish it. This is only sagum. We are only farming sagum here now. It is only sagum which we are farming here. Then, after we finish farming sagum, that's whereby we will start with the simsim and groundnut, you know. Farming of groundnut is a big deal here. It's a very, very big deal. One must have a very, very large farm for groundnut farming. For groundnut farming, you know. We like groundnut so much. We eat groundnut in so, so many ways. We, they make 
whatever groundnut pass with the food in the soup and also eat it with with bread and other things you know there is no soups i mean uh, sauce without meat without whatever Co- cooks without the uh, groundnut yeah. pass here yeah. they add it they add immediately looks at my experience guys I, I told you before that I'm not good with ho ho I'm not good with it but I'm trying only that the handle is very short the handle is made for for young and you know you can't see me bending like that because it is uh, the handle is not that whatever the handle is not that uh, fine the handle is not that fine no it's good for one to work so that you can get the sweat when you get the sweat those small small whatever sickness like malaria headaches fever and what they go with the sweat you know they go with the sweat that's why i always like to do hard works for me to sweat for this small small whatever to go away you know I like farming so much guys I like farming so much only what discourage me is the farm you know our farm here they are not all that fertile fertile but a time is when it rain nicely it uh, brings goods whatever but sometimes it discourage people badly like this place is is uh, cultivated this year it it spent about one year without people coming to cultivate here because we wanted to get enough we never never enough fertile but right now it got it that's why we cut the trees and clear the whole farm that time and it is likely to do well now the little part we have cultivated that time ago is now doing the crops are doing well they are coming up healthily they are coming up healthily which is very very good so it is what it is guys it is what it is we have to work you know rains give us free water and it is time to use it it is time to make use of rain water you know to get something out of it it is actually a gift for a very big gift from god god give us gift of rain so that we can cultivate and and produce our food by our own you know it is something that we can miss especially in this season this rainy season we we can miss that we make sure we cultivate enough so that we can have enough in a store so that we can have enough food in a store for us to be food secure you know for us to be food secure you know buying food and stuff in the market nowadays is very very is scaring you know okay. the prices have skyrocketed have skyrocketed and if you go to market to buy always you will spend more you will be spending more and that will not make you f even so it's good to have foods in your store then you go and buy other small small things in the market you know that's the plan right now hmm? that's the plan right now you know yes it is what it is farming is a job for everyone guys farming is a works for everyone everyone participate i'm asking you once again guys to subscribe click like and share video i think i will end the video here thank you bye bye